Hey guys, Brandon here at SlingMods.com and today we have our plug and play SSV Works audio system for the Can-Am Riker and Riker Rally. Let's face it folks, anyone that owns a Riker will tell you firsthand that there's really nothing better than hitting the open road while listening to your favorite tunes. Which is why we partnered up with our friends over at SSV Works to bring you guys this. Our weatherproof 200 watt Bluetooth audio system that features dual 4 inch coaxial kicker marine audio speakers that are encased in a custom made injection molded speaker enclosure. You'll also get a 200 watt onboard amplifier that mounts in your glove box with the included mounting bracket. Then once installed, you'll be able to control your favorite streaming music through the included MRB3 Bluetooth audio receiver with volume, track, and EQ adjustment. This audio system has been specifically designed for the Can-Am Riker and includes all necessary brackets and wiring harnesses for a truly 100% plug and play installation. So now follow me as I walk you through the installation process on one of our shop Rikers. So start by opening your glove box and removing these four push pins. Then slide open your fuel door to remove these other four push pins so that you can remove these two side panels. Now take off your hood and disconnect your negative battery terminal. Then take a T20 Torx and unscrew these two screws from the front of your glove box. Push down on these two tabs to release the top panel and lift up your glove box just enough so that you can unplug these two wires from your USB connector. Before removing the glove box completely. Next, you can take the right hand side mounting bracket and attach it to the back side of your gauge cluster with the two included Allen screws, followed by the left hand side bracket. And tighten those down with a five millimeter Allen wrench, making sure not to over tighten. Now you can mount up the speaker system to the brackets using the T30 torque screws and washers from the kit leaving them finger tight for now. Then take a T30 Torx wrench and begin tightening them down the rest of the way. And make sure that the system is nice and straight before tightening them all the way down while still making sure not to over tighten. Next, take a large wrench and loosen the nut on the back of your USB plug. So that you can remove it and transfer it over to the MRB3 brain tray. Reinstall the nut. And use the wrench again to snug it up, making sure not to over tighten. Now take your MRB3 brain tray and line it up to the back of your glove box so that it sits all the way down and flush with this top section without pinching any wires. And then once you have it where you want it, mark the four holes with a marker. Next, take a 1 8 inch drill bit and drill a pilot hole at each one of the marks you made. Then take a 5 16 drill bit and drill out those pilot holes from the outside of the glove box. Now take the rubber grommet from the kit and slide it into the hole of where your USB plug used to be. Then take the wiring from the speakers and MRB3 
and run them from the back under this small top panel to the front where your glove box goes. It's a tight fit, but with a little finagling, you'll be able to work the wires forward with the rest of the factory wiring. Now connect the male spade connectors from the speaker system to the female connectors that your USB plug used to be connected to, making sure that you plug the red to the red wire and the black to the black wire. Next, you can take all the wiring from the speaker system and run them through the rubber grommet and into your glove box. Pulling through the slack as you go. And then placing the glove box back into position. Now you can take the female end of the spade connectors from your speaker system and plug them into the male spade connectors on the back of your USB plug that we mounted to the MRB3 brain tray, making sure that the red wire goes to the positive plug and the black wire goes to the negative plug. Now you can connect the antenna, front speakers, the MRB3 controller and MRB3 power connector. Then tuck in all your wires, place your MRB3 brain tray into position over the holes we drilled, making sure not to pinch any wires, then insert the push pins to hold it in place. Next, you can attach the back cover to the speaker bracket using the two silver Phillips head screws on the back. And then the two black Phillips head screws on the front. And then finally, you can reattach the two side panels. Reconnect the negative battery terminal and reattach your hood. The system is controlled by the MRB3 media controller, which allows you to choose between either AM, FM, or Bluetooth. It features a backlit hyper white LED display for clear visibility during the day and at night and it's weatherproof since we know some of you like to ride in the rain. To connect your MRB3 controller to Bluetooth, first make sure your device is Bluetooth enabled and your SSV MRB3 is turned on and set to BT Music. Then go into your phone's available Bluetooth devices, select the SSV Works MRB3 option, and this will connect you to the head unit so you can begin to tune to your desired settings. As far as tuning goes, there are preset EQs such as flat, classical, pop, rock, jazz, and metal, as well as independent bass and treble control so that you can fine tune the EQ to what sounds best for your type of music. Once everything is set the way you like it, pull up your favorite track and let it rip. Count wins when they got it on record, off record. I let them take advantage. I was wildin' on record, off record deals. Tell them talk to Colin for the quote on record, off record. I still want the act, not the ghost. Oh, for the record, I'm done trying to make y'all comfortable. For the record, you ain't trying to go to the stuff. 
Now, if rocking while rolling your Riker is on your mod list, then be sure to head on over to slingmods.com today and grab a plug and play audio system for yourself. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so I can keep you up to date with everything Riker. I'm Brandon signing out. Till next time.